this video, we move to the another part, I group. There is a three all together. Uh, one is the Creole and the HTML formats. Secondly is uh, the divider or separator and then the reference. So uh, Creole, so it uh, look like here. So with uh, some special uh, the format uh, characters, uh, we can uh, make those bold the italic. That's uh, primarily is used in the markup uh, language. Uh, then is uh, uh, we can use that in uh, our plan to ML as well. So uh, let's uh, test for that. So first of uh, let's go to uh, the mind map here under the Creo and the HTML 1.19. Uh, I put our link that you can come to here. If you click this, it is uh, open the cheat sheet. Uh, so this uh, cheat sheet is uh, like this way. So it's coming to the wiki creo.org. Uh, here you can see the now is the Creo 1.0. What is Creole? Creole is a common wiki markup language to be used across different wikis. It's not replacing existing markup, but it instead enable wiki user to transfer content seamlessly across wiki, uh, and for novice user to contribute more easier. Uh, so we uh, uh, can see here uh, if you. Uh, Bookmark this uh, page. Uh, you can use uh, those uh, uh, the cheat sheet. So uh, we will demo this uh, uh, all together. So and then uh, the second part of this code is the, about a certain the standard uh, HTML, uh, the formats. So let's create uh, our 1.0. Uh, let's see, uh, 0 0.1 and 19. Pump. I. Oh, it's a, a PUML, so star UML and UML, then let's make preview. So as usual, so Creo and the HTML format in notes. It's uh, not only in the notes, uh, you can use that in the standard uh, area. So, so we put a uh, make a two, so participant at least. Another is uh, participant. Yeah, let's uh, change at least to actor. Then we can have uh, participant. So let's uh, come to this uh, Creo. The cheat sheet, you can see double star before and after is bold. Uh, double slash before and after is uh, italic. If you have uh, one star is the level one bullet, two star is the level two bullet. Uh, and the pound is uh, like our number, the list. And also something is uh, interesting is uh, if you have these uh, curly braces is the image with title. So you can put the image here and the title here. So uh, we, we can uh, make something. So for example, I put this as an image, I think. So let me save image to our file. GitHub pump. Long UML and put uh, here, here, just a uh, globe. So we will use that uh, later on. So uh, let's uh, starting to, to do this. Uh, so when we have uh, two stars, uh, if you use a uh, markdown, uh, some these uh, Creole format are same to the markdown language. So now you can see famous is uh, getting bold. And uh, Bob, we put this uh, as Bob, so we will use this Alice on the ground. So Alice send a message to Bob with uh, hello. So by default, this is the hello. And we can use uh, Creole. Is the, let me uh, come to here. If we have a single line, where, but here is not uh, so uh, the complete, I think. 
uh, but if you uh, put here, I think it's uh, test case elements, uh, link, bold and italic, list, line break, paragraph. Oh, it's, uh, it's this one. Super, this is the strike. Strike like same as uh, underline. So here you see the double hyphen. So we will use the, this hello and the double hyphen there will be the strike. So we will have this message. So this is one creel, uh, the uh, part. And then uh, we will have this uh, some long delay. So this three dot is not the creel, it's the UML, uh, the syntax, it means the delay. So delay, you see the difference is uh, here. Is uh, black, this uh, dotted, uh, the uh, dashed, come to this uh, right dotted line, uh, dotted. So that is the creel, uh, and then now long delay is uh, creel. So we, uh, we will put that uh, wave line. So it's a long delay. Wave line, and then stopped by this uh, dot dot. Then this we will continue, so node left. And then end node. So then we go create our left node. So let's see, so this is bold. So double, this is the, yeah, the end. Uh, we should back our, so Alice get from Bob are okay. So our message notes is uh, on this okay message. And this is if a double slash is the italics. So finish with uh, double slash. Then that is the creel. So it's coming to see here slash and this is mono space. And this is a stroke. So we already see from there. And this is uh, use uh, underscore, not the hyphen, will be the underlined. In short, it's a before and after, both you need the uh, double the character with line, so under with line. Let's see what we uh, may have uh, anything else uh, from our cheat sheet. So here, or substitute. So let's let's see. So whether we can have our image. What is the image? Image means uh, I have this one. This is a image. I have the globe. This is. logo dot png globe let me see the, this underscore oh it's a uh, globe b but it's not coming so globe logo png let's see what's the syntax title so this kind of uh, creo uh, syntax is uh, not supported Let me see here if I put this uh, four, then 
Oh, I got a horizontal line. That is correct. And here is the table. Table is same as the markdown. And what's this one? This uh, image is uh, not uh, support, I think. So globe is the title. And with this, so not support. I will leave that. So that is the end of the, let me see, but not supported. And then Alice is coming to Bob with the next message so that we can show you the second part for HTML. So, uh, well, now you know well, it uh, should be this uh, double slash formatted message. And then note right. So we will make another. So note right. Also, the, this will be uh, not our uh, the right of Alice, and we will have our end note. So right of Alice. So then that's come. Oh, I put our Bob, B O B B O B. Here, B O B. Why I have a B B O? Oh, here. And I putting this uh, color coding. So this is. So color, in, uh, we use uh, this uh, less than, uh, or it's a tag. Syntax is uh, back means the background. Color. Added blue, so that is a one color code. So you you can make first like our HTML tag. So you can use this back and the closing that is displayed. So then they have this color and use the size. They put that is like a similar like the CSS those style. Then you close that as our HTML tag. Uh, and if you want to make that bold, I think we, we can have uh, such kind of way. So that is a bold. So, but here, I think uh, the author doesn't uh, make that bold. So, but here, I see it's a kind of the bold. And this is uh, underscore is a left off. So uh, because it's already uh, multi-line, so we can just uh, enter and left off. This is underscore and this. That is uh, this box. Now let's go to the another box. Note left uh, off. So I keep show you this uh, uh, situ uh, this kind of the behavior is uh, when you have our multi line uh, this uh, name keywords uh, try to see whether you need the end keywords uh, if need uh, use that immediately then you can uh, very safety to key in the content without uh, generate error. Uh, so here first is the. Uh, is our normal text, uh, normal font, but have our underscore. But now we will put this uh, underscore uh, color. So this means that uh, U is underscore, and we give our color. So if we don't have uh, that, so we can also use uh, this uh, U tag to make the underscore. Uh, and like the CSS, so we can here uh, give our color a code. So I think it's a U color. This uh, should be, oh, this I think is uh, not rendered uh, as what I want. So this red, so let's say blue. Also not rendered. So Maybe I put like this. No, so 
So this is uh, interesting, and the display is the color with display with close color. So we have a U is already. So let me see whether I should have color red. So this uh, color is uh, actually the font color. So we should have our U color. So this is red. It's not to uh, work. Oh, no, it's a uh, work. So I'm not sure it's, uh, if I uh, make this uh, blue. Font is uh, blue. Font, I think it's a font color and underscore color is uh, getting same. So if I change this to green. So this one is uh, not, uh, is not take uh, effect. But if I put this uh, red, it's also change the underscore. So this is the uh, you need to uh, pay attention to because the this uh, U red uh, looks like it's uh, not working. So I will take notes and uh, possible raise a question to the forum. So now double star is the bold and left off. We are reading that to bold and we give them a color. So this color will go to the font purple and the color of is our close and then we put is uh, as means uh, the stroke color so first let's uh, make our stroke first so as all this uh, Strike both is uh, working. So let's make right up here. I can have this line change. Looks like it's this line is also not changed. And then Bob. So we put this uh, bold is uh, come to the end. So that is uh, come to here. Uh, but this one. Uh, is the I will put our question and this one I will put our question so so that we we know actually this is not uh, effect and uh, last is uh, let's see so this uh, image so it looks like is uh, when we use this uh, creo uh, we haven't I'll uh, make that support using this way. Uh, and now let's uh, test uh, this HTML format over Alice and the Bob. That is same as the across, so end the note. <coughs> so we will have the R W. W is the wave. So. I think it's the color is uh, not working as well. So let me put this less uh, red. So this wave is uh, not working. So by image. Let's put this uh, our image is uh, the low logo. PNG. Oh, cannot decode. So this one IMG globe PNG. Oh, gee. hope is the uh, picture is coming. Oh, so HTML is a uh, picture is uh, okay. Uh, but for the Creo, so here I will put our question mark. So from this uh, sample, we go to three parts, uh, have some question mark, uh, and also this uh, strike, also, 
uh, also for, let me see is uh, that is four uh, areas uh, doesn't uh, follow the sample's uh, image uh, or this uh, diagram. Uh, I will see uh, which one is we will need to wait uh, raise to the discussion forum. So I hope it's uh, later when you s uh, watch this video is uh, some of the uh, the questions already get answered by the forum. Uh, but you can also help me to give a comments on whether there's uh, anything uh, missed I should uh, reconfig. Okay, see you then.